up, yo? It's your boy, Vinny, and my little sister, Maya. Hey, guys. <laughs> and we're coming to you all with some Upstreet Online. It's going to be a great day, and we want to let you guys know if you're ever in Georgia, we'd love to see you at Upstreet in one of our churches. Yeah, because in person is so, like, you know. Uh... Personal? Yeah. Well, let's get the fun started here. And be sure to check out that new video from that show with. That guy. Welcome back to another episode with that show with that guy, Caleb Morgan. I don't have a, a nameplate, but just imagine it. We're talking about generosity this month, and so I'm trying to find ways all month where I can be generous. One way that I think would be super fun to be generous would be to put a smile on people's faces. In order to do this, I needed some supplies, so if you would just real quick And you're probably wondering, Caleb, I'm up here. <laughs> Caleb, what are, you, what are you doing with all these things, man? Let me show you. Let's go. Bob. Got it. First try. Here we go. <laughs> Hi, I'm Caleb. Nice to meet What's you. What's your name? Addy. Today, I am spreading generosity oh. around your office by delivering telegrams. So, is there anybody here who you would like to send a message yes. to in a specific costume? Specific, it's yes, my choosing. husband. Oh. Ryan, right down the hall. Ryan, yes, yes. Yep. awesome. Um, what do you want me to tell him? I want you to tell him to finish our master bathroom. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. In the chicken costume. In the chicken. chicken. Oh my god. Right. Oh. Ryan, Ryan, here we come. Okay. Finish the bathroom, please! Ah! <laughs> okay, will you please finish the bathroom for, for Addy? Yes, I can do that. Okay, thank you, Ryan. Okay, bye. Can you deliver a message to Brit Kitchen? Brit Kitchen. And I want you to be Elvis. I will I will be Elvis. Hey, where's Brit? Hello, Brit. Um Elvis the King, you're doing a great job. Also, I'm Elvis the King. <laughs> same, I know, I feel the same way. I feel the same way. Um, you should be a pirate. I'll be, I will be a pirate, okay. And I need you to give her a pirate joke. I got you. All right. We'll make it happen. Awesome, thank We'll make you. it happen, thank you. Arr, I'm looking for <laughs> Leslie. Leslie? <laughs> Me? Leslie, I have a joke for you. What kind of socks do pirates wear? Oh, I don't know. Argyle. <laughs> why did you? Why did you laugh at that? I was so I felt so funny. Argyle, that was awesome. Well, that is all the time we have today for spreading generosity. Here's the thing, guys. All it really takes to spread generosity is to. Look around and do it. Two easy steps. Look around, step one. Just do it. Step two. Bingo, bango, bongo, you're done. Cool? <laughs> Guys, we'll see you on the next episode. Until then, stay with me. Stay saucy. Love on somebody this week. And I'll see you next time. Peace! All right, Upstreet. So this month, we're talking about generosity. Giving what you got to help others. Which is fine for you, Vin, because you're like an adult. Ish. <gasps> Ish? Yeah, I mean, you have a job, but you eat pizza for breakfast. Well, that's because it's great. <laughs> and to your point, Maya, uh, you don't have to be an adult to be generous. Well, I don't know, because it's like I don't have a job, and Dad doesn't give me an allowance, so it's like, how am I supposed to give if I don't have a lot to give? That's a good question, isn't it? Cause like, do you guys have a job? No? I didn't either when I was a kid. So how do you give, or how do you be generous when you don't have a lot to give? Well, there was a time that Jesus talked about this very thing. Let me tell you about it. Hey Daniel, can you bring out my money cases? Here you go. 
thank you very much. Okay, so when Jesus was here on earth, churches were called temples. And in a temple, there was a place called a treasury. Horror, me hearties, did someone say treasure? Uh, no, not pirate treasure, uh, church treasury. There were no pirates in this story. Not one? No, just hold the treasury, okay? Got it. Got it. Thank you. So, the treasury was a place in the temple where people could come give their money. The money was used to help people. The writer Mark in the Bible said one day Jesus was there watching people give their money. He watched as this, oh, super rich person gave, wow, this dude is straight rolling in the cash. Shiver me timbers, he gave like a million dollars. Yeah, it's pretty amazing. And look, he still has tons left. But then Jesus watched as a lady approached the treasury and look what she had, just two coins. Not very much, right? But Jesus watched as the woman took both of her very last coins and gave them to the treasury. Thank you, Buccaneer. You're welcome. Again, there are no pirates in this story. But you guys tell me something. This guy gave a ton and this lady gave two coins. But who was the most generous? Tell me. Yes, that's right, the lady. Because why? Because she gave all she had. Did she have a little or a lot to give? She had a little, but she gave everything. This guy still had a ton left over for himself, which is why Jesus said, Truly I tell you, this poor woman has put more into the treasury than all the others. They gave out of their wealth, but she put in everything, all she had to live on. See, to Jesus, generosity is more about what's in your heart than how much you give. Thanks for your help. Look, if you have a little or you have a lot, just give. Find ways to be generous. Jesus wants us not to be selfish, but to always be looking for ways that we can give to one another. Whether you have a little or a lot, that you'd have a heart inside that's generous. Let's pray. Dear God, thank you for every good thing you give to us. Help us to have a heart of generosity and to give and share what we have with others, even when we don't have a lot. We love you. Amen. Command them to do good, to be rich in good deeds, and to be generous and willing to share. 1 Timothy 6.18Wow, I don't know about you guys, but I'm inspired. That lady only had two coins and she gave... Everything! You know what I was thinking? Woo! Pizza for lunch? Nope, that's you. I was thinking about that teddy bear that sits on my bed and how the little girl down the street would love him. We should see if we could surprise her. With pizza? No, the bear. Oh, even better. <laughs> Did you see her face? She loved it. Oh yeah, give me some way to be generous, Maya. Hey, you all be generous too. This week, I want you all to find a way to give something to someone else to help them out. Hey, peace.
and change and it starts with me one head high Feel your light in the sky We're gonna keep it shining forever Oh, oh, oh. It's brightest when we're shining together This little light 